Yo, yo, yo. All right, um, like always, bro, let's start this podcast off by saying what's up to my boy Carlos right there behind the cameras. Um, if you need any uh, video or photography, uh, go look at my boy. Go check him out. Carlos uh, Martinez, right? Carlos, I'm sorry. Um, shout out to my shop, bro, Dark Rose Tattoo Gallery. To all my boys out there, uh, George, uh, AB, Jose, and Huche. Uh, you got any shout outs to do, um, Ocampo? Shout out to my shop, Gold Rose Tattoo Company. We got Ocampo Tattoos, that's my boy. <laughs> we got Frankie Inc. We got Carlos Martinez behind the camera. <laughs> we got, who else? We got Boss. We got Alpha. Crystal. We got Alpha. Shout out to my boys, all them. And girl. Hell yeah. Um, with that being said, bro, we got our boy right now. We got our boy, um, Rene Estrada, Chico. From, uh, what are you from? Uh, from Anaheim. My bad. Bro. California. Anaheim. Anaheim, yeah. That's where you were raised or that's where you like? I was born there. Born uh, there? Uh, lived there for a little while. Um, tell, them, tell them where you, uh, where you tattoo at right now. Old Ghost Tattoo in Raleigh, downtown Raleigh. Old Ghost? Oh, yeah. yeah. I heard of it then. Old Ghost? Old Ghost Tattoo, yeah. Where are they at? It's in downtown Raleigh. Yeah. Nice, nice. How long you been doing it for, bro? Tattooing? Yeah, just overall. Professionally, um, I'd say about 11 years, but I started tattooing out of my house when I was about 14 years old. Oh, yeah. yeah. 14? Yeah, so about 16 years. Is that what, what um, did you always draw? Were, yeah, I always drew when I was like, like a little what, kid. What, um, I guess like the question I get asked a lot is like, um, what made you want to get into like the, the, tattoo, <clears throat> the tattoo industry? Um, I always wanted to do something with art. Um, I actually want to be an architect when I was younger, but um, when I moved over here in North Carolina, uh, I met this, uh, this dude in ninth grade. He was in my math class, I think. Um, we used to draw together. So you went to school time. in California? Uh, California and here. I moved over here when I was in How long did you go grade? to school in California for? Until seventh grade. Seventh grade? Yeah. Oh, damn. So you spent a couple of years in yeah, California then? Yeah, until I was okay, about 13 okay, okay. years old. Okay. Moved out here. Yeah, That's I met this so dude, and we used to draw together and all, all that, and then one day he came in, and he was like, oh, I got myself a tattoo kit, and I was like, oh, shit, you know, that's yeah, that's yeah. cool. And that's I was like, awesome. you think you can get me one? Yeah. He was like, yeah, just, you know, give me the money, I'll bring you the stuff, and two weeks later, he came to school, and he got me, you know, all the machine, the power supply, all, everything I needed, pretty much. You know, so he was, was your like, sponsor? Yeah. <laughs> that's <laughs> what you would call him right, right you now. Know, you know, one of those yeah. cheap You still remember kids. him until right now, you said? Yeah, well... I, don't, I haven't talked to him, but yeah, like yeah. I, I, I still have him like as a friend on Facebook and stuff. Like, what yeah. um, what, what what part? Of my, I probably didn't hear you right, but what part of Cali you say you from? Anaheim. Anaheim. Yeah. Anaheim. Yeah. I, got, I saw I you in Compton later. like two weeks ago or a week ago, right? Yeah, it was like two weeks ago. Yeah, yeah my cousin lives. I was out like, there. damn, my boy, I didn't come. Yeah. Yeah. That's what's up, bro. That's cool. <laughs> I was like, Cali, there. bro. Cali's hell, yeah, I love Cali, bro. Yeah. I was only out there for five days though, tattooing most of the time. So. That ain't enough time though. Yeah, I love Cali, bro. Yeah, the smoke out there, the smoke, the vibe, oh, everything, yeah, yeah. bro. It's just chill out there, bro. Yeah, it's a whole different. I don't know if you got like, I don't know if you know people out there like that, but man, if you know people out there, bro, man. Yeah, I got a couple of cousins out there. So yeah. family. Yeah. I think you were telling me earlier. Yeah, yeah. you tattooed your cousin. Now, you said? Yeah, I tattooed two of my cousins yeah. actually. That's the yeah, song, yeah. and one of his, uh, one of the girls. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, oh, yeah. Well, something yeah, on yeah, That's what's up, bro. I feel like everybody has to hustle out there, bro. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah, for yeah, sure. Like everything's yeah, it's expensive out there. So like, yeah, you definitely gotta hustle. I got tattooed by um. My boy um, Cliff, Cliff underscore Incar or something. I can't remember. He's from California. But he works at, um, well, he used to work at Under the Gun. I don't know where he works at now. I can't remember the name of the shop off the top of my head. But I think I know who you're talking about, Cliff. You know, yeah, Cliff, yeah, yeah, he yeah, worked yeah. with Este Ebon Capone yeah, and yeah, yeah. Um, Conchente Rios. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. No, he so he worked with them, bro. And like, I went and got tattooed by him. And I'm over there. I'm like, well, I got there, um, I think on a Monday. And um, I was going to be there for like a week and a half or something like that. And. Um, it's the, I hit him up like the next day when I got there, and I was like, "Hey man, I'm like I'm in Cali, bro. I know it's last minute, you know. What I mean, I can, I want to get something done by you, bro. If you're yeah. free, by and he hit me up right up. He's like, "Hey bro, he's like, hey, you free tomorrow?" So I was yeah. like, "Fuck yeah, bro. Yeah, 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 I'm like hell yeah, bro. That's what's up. And bro, and what no, what, what what fucking blows my mind, bro? Out of everything is like, I'm expecting him like how much like for example, how much would you think he would have charged me for my hand, bro? Looking at my hand. How long ago was this? This was five, six years. Uh, let me see. Uh, it's probably been like six years ago. There you go. Yeah, probably I, longer, bro. More, bro. Probably longer, actually, like yeah. eight years ago. Yeah. How much would you have said? Uh, probably like around five. Yeah, like. yeah, yeah. He said three fifty, but I gave him. Yeah. Yeah. 
I was like, bro, three feet? Yeah, like, no, that's Whoa. cheap. Yeah. Like an artist like him. Yeah, like, yeah, for real, bro. I expected, like, I thought he was going to be like, hey. Huh? 2211. I think, bro, that shit on fucking live. <laughs> it's because everybody's fucking <coughs> competitive out there, bro. You got to oh, yeah, hustle. Yeah, and you, everybody's so good that you got to cut the prices down sometimes. It's crazy because, like, it's crazy you know? because, like people out here charge, like, a lot, bro. Yeah, and, compared like, to You go to California and people are charging nothing. Yeah. It's like I mean, there's definitely of, an artist out there that charges a lot, though. Like, oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Higher yeah, than yeah, for sure. what we yeah, do. Yeah, yeah. 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 Bro, I just took a seminar from a guy from Europe, and he was just saying the same shit, bro. Everybody out there. Like, people, Americans are likely to go over there and get tattooed because of the price, because of the, yeah. you know, the, the area and everything. Was he from Europe or, like, straight he's from Europe? Denmark. Does he work here, or is he from... Um, yeah, I think he's going back and forth. And yeah. couple sh- he's got spot in a couple shops. He's trying to make it out here, but he's he's from Denmark. But he was saying the same thing, bro. Like, we charge a lot out here. Like, people are actually... Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. You're actually moving... People are moving out here so they can start charging that. And, like, you know, yeah, it's going to be a big saturation of artists, like, yeah. coming up. There already is, but... Yeah, oh yeah, there's it's definitely getting more bro. saturated for sure. But yeah, definitely, bro. Still, still get clientele. I mean, I think you, as long as you got your own clientele, bro, that's all. Yeah, exactly. That's all you can get. You can't tattoo the whole world anyway. Yeah, you know? yeah. We, I tattoo one a day. I don't know how many people you tattoo. But no, just one a day. Yeah, yeah, yeah one a day. Yeah, same here. So it's like you know, how many people can you tattoo a week? Seven, t- seven people a week is a lot to me. Yeah, you know? that's too much. You got sessions you know, and that's take yeah. some time for yourself, relax, yeah, take some rest. So it is what it is, right? I think. Boy, imagine, fine. imagine, bro. <clears throat> like for example, like in Fayetteville, and like um, me and my boy were talking about it the other day. Me and um, AB, like, bro, there's like fifty something shops in Jacksonville, bro. Yeah. It's like imagine how how do they all like manage to live? You know what I mean? Yeah. How do they all manage to pay their bills, bro? When they're like, oh yeah, the rent's like two thousand dollars. I'm like, bro, you know how much people, how many people you got a tattoo to make that much, bro? Like. I wonder that. I'm like, man, how do they make it, bro? Unless they're charging their ass, bro. You know what no, I mean? Yeah, like, they definitely charge more, bro. Depending on where you are, you're going to charge more. Definitely. Yeah, also depending, like, on your following and all that. Yeah, yeah, for yeah. sure. And Shit, bro. Look, with that being said, bro, like, what's your what's your prices like? Or, like, what's your... I charge by the hour. 150 You do by the hour? Now. You don't do daily sessions? You do just straight up by the hour? No, I don't do it. Yeah, I just do by the hour. Yeah, uh, yeah. I've been thinking about raising it up to 175 you said 150 an hour? Yeah, 150. I think that's about charging. fair, bro. Yeah, I yeah. think that's about what everybody does right now, right? Yeah. yeah. yeah, that's yeah. Right. Unless, you're, unless, you're, unless you're Ocampo tattoos, he does <laughs> 200 an hour. Nah, you know? yeah, no. I think once you're fast enough, bro, like, yeah, you can charge 150 all day, bro. Yeah. <laughs> and you gave me the red mic, too, rather like a fucking clown. <laughs> Already little, you, know? you gotta raise it up. Yeah, let's <laughs> Get to your nose. <laughs> Sorry. Nah, bro. Hey, man, shout out to my boy Chico, bro. Tattoos by Chico 919. Tattoos by Chico 919. No underscores, no dots. No, no, no underscores, no dots. Tattoos by Chico. No, there's somewhere. Look for it. That's cool, man. How long have we known you for now? Uh, How long have you known him for? Sorry, now let me stop. (laughs) We probably met in Cinco de Mayo, probably. Like, like two, three years? I think that's when we met. Did you go to Carlo? Did, Did you go to the first Cinco de Mayo or no? I don't think so. I think no. I think it was just. I think I was looking at a picture the other day. I think it was just us, me, you. I think Carlos, it was the second one. I, Mar- I think Mario too. was there too. I remember it was like yeah. here, like in front of the shop. We no, took it picture. was at Carlos' shop. I think the first one, right? The first single. Yeah, it was in, yeah, it was in Carlos. Yeah, shop. I, it was at I, Carlos I shop. Oh. Yeah, I think the second one oh, might have been here. The last one was here. No, over there, in my shop. Yeah, we were burning up. Yeah, yeah. I got in trouble for that shit, bro. Yeah. For real? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they're always them. burning. Somebody's always burning out. All the fucking time, bro. If it's not AB, it's fucking Jose, bro. Or me. <laughs> <laughs> I can't. I don't know how to burn out, bro. I just learned like nah, two days ago. Really? Say nah. Nah, I'm <laughs> Hey, I saw, hey, what? Yo, talking about trucks. What? Yo, what, what you whipping? Uh, 90 Silverado. Bro, that shit is nice. Bro, no, nah, when he no, nah, when I when I was pulling in, I saw him pulling out. I was like, yo. I'm I don't like, pull out, bro. I was like, <laughs> bro. bro. <laughs> 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 so, nah, bro. Real nah, man, nah, yeah, yeah. It's nice. I just got it like probably like three months ago, man. Yeah. yeah. That's what's up. Oh, nice. That shit is nice, bro. Yeah, I'm, uh, what year is it? Lower, uh, 90. 90. 1990. Yeah. So sad, sport, sport it's cute. Single cap, single cap. He says it's cute. Cap, yeah. <laughs> I'm riding. That shit's it. nice, bro. That shit's nice. I thought Dave was beside you when y'all was pulling out. Uh, I don't know. I thought Ooh. I saw somebody beside you on the passenger side, but I guess no, 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 no. I just What's up, Mike? Boys, bro? <laughs> What's up, bro? <laughs> shout out to my boy Mike Sierra. Shout out to Mike Sierra. Ink dabs, ink gloves. Ink dabs, ink gloves. He helps with what he can. 
He's here when he's he's, he's here when he's here. He's, he's here, here when he's here. <laughs> shout out to Mike. Shout out to Mike. <laughs> shout out to Mike. <laughs> but um, anyways, um, damn, bro. Um, how much you pay for it? If you don't want me asking. How much do I pay for what? The truck. I paid eleven. Eleven. No rust or nothing? No. Nah. Oh, good? Yeah, I'll rest <laughs> it on. You gonna drop yeah. it or you gonna leave it? I'm gonna lower it a little bit. You gonna drop it? Yeah. Hell yeah, bro. That's I'm not gonna see no shit, but I'm gonna, you gonna drop I'm gonna lower it. it. Yeah. You, as got, much you, as you I can, already got yeah. somebody that's gonna do it for you? Or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. I'm about to say, I, I got know. somebody too, bro. I got a client that did it for like one of my own means. That's what's up. Yeah, yeah, that's what's up. Can I pass it to the Hey, I'm about to take a shot. Sponsors. On this podcast. I wanna shout out our sponsors. Wait, is that in Facebook or podcast? They're making me take a shot, bro. I'm not. I'm not trying to take this. Oh, take a shot, <laughs> bro. <laughs> oh, here. It's right now. I love. Oh, that's good. That's good. Shut your mouth. Oh, you still got it. He said we're gonna we're gonna act like we poured a shot. Cheers, guys. Cheers, guys. Hey, man. Shout out to my boy Chico once again, boys. Cheers. Cheers. Shout out to my boy Chico. <sighs> Some ASMR. Yes, or you can sir. taste that shit, huh? Hey, bro, I think I asked you earlier, right? You said it's your first podcast, no? You been on? Yeah, my first podcast. First podcast. <clears throat> you did a, um, you did a, what was it, a tattoo giveaway not long ago? Yeah, uh, about like a little over a month ago. A month ago, like yeah. Like it ended in Is, June, it, is it done with you already? Yeah, you already, yeah. You already did the tattoo? Or? Yeah, I did the tattoo yeah. probably like a, like a week or two after. Okay. Yeah, I just did it on one of my days off. What'd you do? I did uh, a Mary piece and then like for the Halo, did some like lettering. Like, I'm like old English, like style of that. Did you pick the design or you still let him choose? It? Yeah, so no, I uh, kind of uh, let him choose it, but he showed me like a reference and then I just chose like a better image, like real similar to what he wanted. Right, right. And then, uh, you know, I just did like, uh, he wanted Perdón on me, like the lettering. Yeah. So I just had to like draw that up. Like some dark black? Yeah, it was like ne- negative lettering. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's, uh, it's probably like the last uh, reel I posted. Like it's up there on my Instagram. Check it out. Yeah. Yeah, bro. That's cool. Bro. I like doing free giveaways, you know, every, yeah. every few often, like. Yeah, yeah, it was the first one I ever did, you know. Really? Yeah. Damn. Yeah, I didn't know how to go about it, but luckily it worked out, like, yeah. last minute, actually. Like, I mean, you're, you're just tattooing for free, basically, bro. Yeah. That's how you yeah, do yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, but I definitely, mean, no. Like, yeah, yeah, like a lot you of make up your mind that. that you're not getting paid for that day. You yeah. still give it it's your free. all. It's free yeah. to a point, you know. It helps. it helps. And it was more yeah, than a thousand dollars. It was more than a thousand dollars. Yeah, it was, yeah, it was, yeah, it was, it was worth it. That's exactly yeah. what I was about to say, bro. Like, like it definitely took like, it was, like, it was a big dude. You didn't just do it like, you didn't just do it like. Yeah, you, you got a big arm, you know, I ain't gonna lie. Like, <laughs> hey, for real. I was like, fuck it, you, you know, I'm just gonna do it. You didn't just do it like, um, like, uh, how can I say, like, uh, like just enter and you win. You had like, no, yeah, you had to put like, like a certain amount too, no? Yeah, to like share, uh, my post. Or like, were you asking like any, like, like some people be like, oh, five dollars. No, 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 and, uh, I didn't ask for anything. Okay, okay, okay. No money. That's what I'm wondering. Yeah. That's better money. That's what's up. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, most people out here are paying for followers, so it's like. Yeah, I know. Like, yeah. I've known about that ever since like I started. Like, yeah. you could you could tell like who has like the fake followers. No, so yeah, yeah, for sure, for sure. Yeah. I'm like, man. Oh, I've had y'all want to dive into that or what? Like, y'all know so now, no. Bro, bro, I've had Instagram. I've had Instagram for what ten years, bro, probably. And bro, I'm still at seven thousand dollars. Seven thousand dollars. Seven thousand followers, bro. <laughs> no, it's yeah. like, bro, I feel I'm like I could have. 10. I feel like I could have yeah, more. 10. You know what I mean? No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, on this thing, um, in Instagram, is yeah, bro. Um, why aren't you getting enough followers, Balon? I don't know. That's I the real the question. Thing. I the same thing. He's not showing his ass cheeks. Ass yeah, bro. <laughs> you gotta show more, more titties and ass. Be like only, only fans. Nah, I'm just kidding. Like that was just a joke. Only that fans below. Nah, <laughs> nah, fuck no. Shit, I joined. Nah, I feel like nah, if I was where I at, where I'm at right now, like five years ago, where Instagram's at, like would have like a lot of more followers. Like I feel like Instagram now is like. Yeah, difficult. Like, I think we talked about it last time like, on the last podcast. Oh, I feel yeah. like um, Instagram's kind of gone down a little yeah, bit. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Like I remember, I was telling them last time, like three years ago, four years ago, we used to get fucking 400, 300 likes on the tattoo, bro. Yeah, same. Now I get like maybe fuck, if I get lucky, 50, 40 likes. Yeah, sometimes I get like a little over 100. Like it's the algorithm, yeah, bro. Now there's like the algorithm. More. Yeah. Before it might have been there, but it was weak. Now they got that. Smart algorithm. Yeah, like, before I used you know? to only post pictures and used to get like yeah. hundreds and hundreds of likes. Yeah, and now you got to yeah, do like yeah, all yeah. the reels and like. That's true. Where I was in a, that seminar, the same seminar, supposedly, I heard, I, I fucking learned something new. I didn't even know this. 
but apparently they'll put you in a different bracket, like the al- algorithm. Yeah. It'll share your content depending on how good the quality is you upload. Yeah. So if you're uploading on an iPhone, it's probably not going to be in like a certain bracket. If you're uploading with like a super high camera, they're going to put you up here. So like you automatically get more views from the quality. If, you, if you're posting quality shit, you know? Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I always try to post everything. Like all my reels are done like with my actual like camera, yeah. not like with my phone. I need to get a camera now, bro. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't know all that. You, I see you got a, is that your camera? Or? No, I, I put mine down over there. Oh, I was okay. just going to tell you guys, it's pretty much like the same angle. So I was just going to tell you guys, send it over to me or send me like a copy of the, oh, okay, the yeah. podcast. And now I'm just going to do my own editing, the other videos that I took. Okay. Oh yeah, yeah, I forgot, bro. Yeah. Um, My bad, bro. Don't mean to interrupt y'all. Not yet. Um, we had a couple of tattoo questions, I think, for you, bro. All right. Um, I'm like, damn, not even Carlos Bonfield got this many questions. Yeah. <laughs> uh. It's the, the first one said, let me see, hold on, let me go. Let me go. Uh, somebody said, um, best advice when first starting to tattoo? Uh, that's the first question. Just keep drawing. What's the first, what's the advice you give for like a first time start to tattoo, I guess? Like, uh, when you're first starting, just like keep drawing, like, uh, keep trying to improve. Um, uh, definitely, you know, pay attention to your surroundings, other artists, like, uh, yeah, yeah. their techniques, um, Everybody has like different hand styles and stuff, so the best way uh, to learn is pretty much practice. Hell yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so, I hear that, you know, man. Try to get some clients out there, you know, some friends that will let you uh, do some stuff that's out of your comfort zone, and, you know, that's the best way to learn, in my opinion. But always yeah. keep drawing, yeah, you know, we got, keep going. We got going questions on. from everywhere, but he said, there's another one. Well, we got like four more. We got this one said, uh, what's, what's the most difficult tattoo you all had to do? Oh, he said, all of us. All of us. What's your, well, let's we'll, we'll start, with, no, we'll start with you, bro. You're the guest. Um, What's the most difficult tattoo you've had to do? Most difficult. I'm not sure, to be honest. Yeah. Not sure. I always think probably, the same it's thing, just, It's just probably just I like the like areas. I feel like they're all hard. Yeah. Just I feel probably, like they're all hard to apply. Yeah, yeah. And depending, like, you know, yeah. I, I feel like it's just like certain areas, like yeah, the ribs. Yeah, the areas, bro. Yeah, yeah the ribs, yeah, yeah, like yeah, the yeah, necks, yeah. like, yeah. I feel like are real difficult areas, so. Yeah. Hell yeah. And it, I think it depends a lot on the clients, too. Like, if they can take the pain or if they're sitting, if they're moving, if, you know. So the most difficult... The most difficult area is kind of hard to explain. Yeah, they're well, all hard. Most difficult to tattoo, at least. But like, yeah. I think there's a. I think the, to me the most difficult area to tattoo, but it also depends on the client. But like yeah. Behind the arm. <laughs> yeah, it's like stuff that has like a lot of line work, like say yeah. on the ribs, just because like they're always yeah. like breathing, so it's like an area that's always. See, they're not going in the like skin, that. or it's going in too much. Yeah. And it's blowing out. And Same you know. thing with the neck, because like you feel like their heartbeat like moving, yeah, like yeah. you can like see it. Yeah, you can like see it. Yeah. I mean, hell yeah. There's a lot. Of, there's a lot of areas for yeah. it. Um, <laughs> uh, the same. The same guy said, um, "What? What's the most expensive tattoo you have ever done? What's the, the most, most expensive, expensive tattoo you've ever done?" Ooh, probably somebody that came two days back to back. It was probably like five months, five six months ago, maybe, maybe a little over. But he did like two days back to back with the tattoo, like nine hours. It was nine hours each day, so it was like eighteen hours. About like damn, three thousand. A lot of questions, bro. Yeah, it's about I'm like, like damn, 000. bro, Chico's got 3, the plug. Chico's yeah. the plug. Bro. <laughs> He's got all glue, bro. We got questions from everywhere. Um, so there's another one, bro. That says, uh, "What's your favorite spot of the body to tattoo?" Probably forearms. What's your favorite? What's what? your favorite spot of the body to tattoo? Forearms yeah. or like the side of a leg, just because like right, a nice yeah, yeah, like yeah, flat yeah. area. What about church? Man? What was the question? Sorry, there were. It's the same ones. Probably I'm watching the same thing. Yeah, it's the same question. La misma. <laughs> La misma, la estoy viendo también. All right, what was the question again? It said, um, what's your favorite spot of the body to tattoo David My O'Campbell? favorite? Shit, probably the forearm, bro. The forearm or the... Not even the... Ca- I mean, I would say the cap, but a lot of people... It hurt. I'm going to say anywhere where I nobody can... Right. I'm going to say anywhere sure. where they can't look at me. <laughs> no. Yeah, I... Right I get nervous when every, like clients when or like, people stare at you. Yeah, I'm just like, hey, bro, I feel like I got anxiety, but bro, no, every I time I go it. around you, bro, I'm like, bro, you you give me anxiety, yeah. bro. Like, bro, <laughs> that's how anxious I am. That's, that's how like, anxious I am. Bro, that time we got to uh, to Carlos's, uh, what was it Vance for, for for Tristan thing? Yeah. Um, it was last. No, it wasn't last year. The year before that. Uh, bro, he got there. I was like, bro, I'm gonna sit up beside you, bro. And we started talking, bro. And I'm like, bro, like, damn, bro, like, you got me tripping. <laughs> you got me with anxiety. Yeah. Nah, bro, nah, that's cool though. Would you do, as the Strata underscore Katana said, would you do a UV tattoo like? <coughs> nah, I don't do. I don't huh? do that kind of stuff. No, I just UV do like black and gray. Yeah. David, David, do you do UV light tattoos? Mr. UV, I've done UV light tattoos. Yeah. Yeah. That's something we offer at the shop. We don't do them a lot, but 
I got some inks to try them out. I did one and I thought, eh, you know, it's okay. It's something else. It's different. It's hard to put it in, but it's, yeah. 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 I mean, just because I also have like a minimum, like two hours booking. <laughs> yeah, so like usually yeah. they just want something small, you know. So I get three hundred dollars for a dot. Yeah. <laughs> UV dot, three dollars. All right, we got another question. Um, Old City Joe said his first tattoo not done on himself. So did you do your first tattoo on yourself or no? No, no, it was on. Somebody tattooed you first. Uh, on myself? Oh, uh, actually, yeah. No, well, I'm, I'm guessing that's what he. I'm guessing that's hey, what, what he said. What was the question? The first it tattoo said his his first tattoo was not done on himself. Laugh out loud. Yeah, no, no. Well, my first actual tattoo that's on by, somebody else. That's by Old City Joe. Yeah, no, no. Joe? That's that's my homie right there. Okay, yeah. you know then. Okay, okay. Yeah, no. Uh, right. My first tattoo on somebody else was on on him actually. Okay, okay. Yeah. Oh, that's what he means then. His yeah. first tattoo not yeah. done on himself. Yeah. Ah, okay, yeah. okay, okay. Tattooed cool. his mom's name on his shoulder. That's what's up. Actually, uh, that's in what front of, in front of one of the homies' earlier. porch. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it was at the porch. Send him a shout out. Send him a shout out. Yes, shout out to Oak City Joe. Oh, it's Oak City. My bad. Yeah, Oak City Joe. Oh shit, my bad. Homeboy crazy. <laughs> oh shit, crazy. Hey, he's about to pull up, bro. Chill, chill. <laughs> hey, I better relax. It's like, hey, um, another one, bro. They said, um, homeboy said he said, "What's your dream piece tattoo to do?" Dream piece. Oof. I don't know. I'm not sure about my dream piece, but like my favorite style is like Chicano style, like a lot of like clown girls and stuff like that. Chicano so, style tattoos. Yeah. yeah so yeah. anything like clown girls, like Chicano, or, like right, Aztec yo, stuff. Yo, you go know. check them out, man. For yeah, some Chicano one. style tattoos. My Chicano. boy, um, what's it? Tattoos by Chico underscore yeah. no tattoos by Chico nine one nine. Chenta te cochun. All right, we got one more question. It <laughs> said um by um, this one right here. Oh goof. He said oh goof. Oh goofy goober. Goofy goober. Quit goofing around. It's the is a question by money money dot Jew. Longest money longest Jew? session he's done nonstop. What's your longest session you've done nonstop? Longest session, um, besides like the two days back to back, is uh, probably like eleven hours, like tattoo time. It was back when I did like color, like it was like a color piece, upper arm. We started at two p.m., didn't finish until two in the morning. Oh, yeah. How about it was you, Long day. I'm been eleven hours. Yeah. Can't remember when we started, but it was like this motherfucker night. be starting like at three o'clock in the afternoon, <laughs> stopping like at five. Yeah. Nah, he yeah, surprised yeah. me today. I'm like, damn, he's working till seven. I'm like, okay. <laughs> That's late for me. Yeah, I've definitely worked later though. Nah, this was, I've worked this until was like, like five. He told me six he told in the me morning before. He was gonna be done at four. <laughs> so I'm like, all right, we'll be done by four. Well, we'll I was be starting here. at four. But, get, nah, you know. but nah, it was back in Dark Rose actually, bro. Right. I had to leave me here, and I was here by myself, and I was just locked myself up. But yeah, it was cool, bro. Eleven hours. The most I felt like shit the next day. But oh, well, I'll say, yeah, the next day. Yeah. Yeah. Definitely wouldn't do two me. eleven but, uh, day, back yeah. to back days. What's the what's the longest you stay at the shop for? Until I'm done, pretty much, or until they tap out. Try to finish the piece every time. Like when they're down, I'm always down to finish it. You got a, um, you have a, like a certain time that you start? Or? I uh, always uh, start like at 11, so they'll get there at 11, you know. I think you told me earlier, you said um, you get there like at what, 10, 9? Uh, I'll get there like two hours earlier, so like 9, 9.30. Me, so me personally, bro, so. I like to get there like an hour, hour and a half before my um, my client does, just yeah. so I can sit there and just like, yeah, no, just I, get my shit together, yeah, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah I'll usually like just chill. Like do you do, what, what's your routine? Oh, that's another question we ask like in the podcast. <laughs> what's your routine that you do like um, on a daily? <laughs> Homeboy sneezed over there. Right? I mean, my daily routine. No, bro, my bad, bro. Uh, I just like to fuck with him, bro. That's my boy. Hey, man, we about to let him jump on here real quick, though. We're we'll take a break real quick. He's gonna be the next one up there asking. He's gonna eat you over questions, bro. He's gonna be asking you some crazy shit. Yeah, I already know. Yeah, that. Already know that. But um. But anyways, uh, what's your like routine, bro? Like starting from the house or yeah, just like, what I get like, to? like since the moment you wake up uh, to the moment you get to leave the shop, bro. Pretty much wake up, let my dogs out. Um, what kind of dogs my, are they? Uh, I got a hound, a mutt. He's a mix, and then two Frenchies. Damn, bro, you got a couple Damn. dogs, huh? Yeah, I got four dogs. Well, you got two up, Frenchies bro. and a hunting dog. Yeah. 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 Hey, bro, that's what's up, though. Yeah, that's what's up, bro. That's what's up. They're that's a handful for sure, but yeah. Hey man, that's, that's your kids, though, bro. Right now. Man. Oh yeah, hey, definitely. Man, you gotta love animals. That's the way to live. He's like who? He's like who? Nah, 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 nah. That's cool. Nah, he's cool. He's, he, he likes cats. He likes cats. I like, yeah, I like everything. I just. Yeah. 
Hey, true story. True story, bro. But he bit you. Pelon. Oh yeah, my dog. Pelon didn't ass, train bro. his dog, right? So this nah, motherfucker nah, bit nah. my ass. Yeah, he bit my ass. Bit his ass. It's not the dog. It's the owner. It's the owner. It's, it's not the dog. The owner, yeah. Don't blame the dog. The yeah. fault. Don't believe that. Yeah. No, bro. He Always bit me, owner, bro. He bit me. Nah, bro. I had to go to the hospital because of him, bro. One time, yeah, bro. He right. bit you on your ass, bro. He bit me on he, my fucking hand, though. Right, he couldn't catch me. I was like, all right, I'll get No, he bit Mike. He, <laughs> yeah, he, he got, got Mike good, dog. He got Mike good. That, that one girl with that. He got Mike good, bro. Yeah, yeah. My, I can show you the video. Bro, I was back there pissing. You want to see the video? We were you drinking, want to see probably. the video? We're going to pull out the video. You got the video, Steve? Of course. We're going to pull out the video. Warning. Anyways, anyways. He downloads that shit. We're going to keep talking, though. The question is, they say, when do you know the skin is already damaged enough? Shit. When do you know when the skin's enough, like damaged enough? Yeah. I'm gonna let you answer that, bro. I'm gonna find this video real quick. So you could, you could kind of tell, like as a tattoo artist, you could tell, like right, the yeah. skin is kind of like tearing apart, oh, like going like yeah, too deep yeah, and yeah, stuff. Yeah, for sure, like, for sure. Um, bro, hey, let him like, answer. Let him answer, bro. My bad, bro. Shit, like bro. too damaged, but like, yeah, you definitely can't overwork the skin. Like if you are, like you gotta like work it lightly, like so it won't like damage it. Yeah, but, yeah, bro. Yeah, you could definitely tell like when it's like tearing. Like, I mean, honestly, really, when it's red. Yeah. When it's too red, you know, yeah. or when it's too like. Swollen, I guess. Yeah, you could, you could tell. Like, you could definitely get like, like swollen, like certain areas, and yeah. Even with like gray wash, it gets a little red, but there's techniques that you can do, and it's not gonna get us irritated. Yeah. So yeah. I mean, some people recommend you know using like witch hazel and stuff instead of like water. Like, I've heard that yeah. a lot, bro. Or, I haven't really like tried it out, but like glycerin. It's basically yeah. any like mixing solution. Yeah. It's basically what it is. I glycerin. use like a little bit of like back team and stuff, like help with the pain, like the, yeah, yeah. the redness. Yeah, we use Bactine all day, bro. <coughs> keep that shit in stock. We keep like four or five in stock. Yeah, yeah. you always keep some in stock. Too. Bactine and Luberderm. Yeah. That's my shit. But like the the damaged skin, bro, like, do you think it's worse than like the skin? Do, do you use numbing cream? Uh, some of my clients do. Yeah. Like if they want to, like, they always well, like, spray like, or anything I, like that? Yeah, nah, nah. Like unless they, like, they want to use it, I'm like, all right, like, we could definitely, but like, I never like tell them, like, hey, hey, hey like, put it on for it. Question, what's better, numbing spray or numbing cream? Numbing cream. Fuck. Numbing cream before, numbing yeah. spray during. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Man, I don't know, bro. Me personally, bro, I'm not going. I'm not trying to like, like, talk bad about. Then don't. <laughs> <laughs> no, go ahead, go ahead. Yeah, turn how you turn this mic off. <laughs> bro. <laughs> nah, hold on. We do not. We are sponsored, and we I do, do not. not. Sorry, no. <laughs> <laughs> we do not stand for the same. That's what. No, 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 no. The thing is, bro, is like, like the the numbing the numbing cream when you put it, bro. I don't know if y'all noticed, but like it turns the skin kind of red. Yeah, I've had that, yeah, yeah, like, yeah, with the yeah. numbing spray. Like, and then, like, put and then on, when like, you during. put the, the spray, like, um, when you try to go over the, the, the skin again with the needle, yeah, I feel like it's, like, like that bro. Yeah. Like, it's rubbery. Uh, yeah, well. Oh, yeah, definitely. Like, like you can really got to, like, wipe it, like, off. Yeah. Like, you're trying like, to, like, do it. Yeah, almost yeah, goosebumpy. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Yeah, like, yeah. almost. Not really almost. It's like a patch of, like, yeah. a... Some clients, it doesn't, like, really do it, but, like, no, I definitely notice, like, the redness and, like... Yeah, I noticed that shit way back in the day when I fucking... I was at a convention... And they had some off-brand numbing shit. You know, back in the day, numbing yeah, stuff. Yeah, was, it was like know? hard to and get. They had some yeah, off-brand shit. They got, another, like question. They got another question for you. Oh, well, fuck me then. All right. <laughs> Sorry, my bad, my bad. Okay, good. All the food's here, by the way. But. It said, uh, do you do tap-out sessions and how much? Uh, I don't do, you do, do tap-out sessions. Nah, no, I don't do tap-out sessions. No tap-out sessions? Out sessions? Nah, I don't, uh, he I don't, don't do, do no tap-out nah, sessions, nah, guys. Sorry. Nah, sorry. 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 Because if I tap out after an hour, I'm going to tell you for real. Hey, that's hey, a tap no, out. No, for no, true story. Hey, I've heard, I've heard no, some people no, do that. No, there's times you got to tap out for yeah, your client. No, bro. Yeah, you know, sometimes no, you got to yeah. tap out, you know. Sometimes I've, I've done it. Like, I've been like, like, hey, look, I got back damage. Hours. You didn't ask. Hey, motherfucker, like, yeah. he'll find you at the bar, bro. I'll tap out. $900. Nah, I mean, never your back hurts, you know, you got to stop, like, for sure. I've definitely, you know, stopped. But I've had my days, though, though. You know what I mean? I've had my days, bro, like, man. He might not tap out, but I'm going to tap out, bro. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah, yeah same. For sure. I've had tattoo artists do that on me, too. You know? Like, where yeah, they tap yeah, out. No, no, I mean, I mean, you don't understand it, though, bro. You've done the tap out session? No, no, like, where, like, artists are tattooing oh, no, me, no, and they're no, like, no, oh, no. You've been tattooed no, by, no. by Herrera, bro. You, you got some Herrera, wrong uh, sessions, bro. Yeah, Darren He's tapped out on you? <laughs> Uh, no, it was, uh, he don't tap out, bro. That motherfucker, let him go, bro. Nah, like, <laughs> shit, I, mean, I tapped out on him, like, nah, yeah, shout out to him, but nah, I tapped out on him, like, nah, like, yeah. Is he heavy-handed? You think he's heavy-handed or no? Well, I, I can't really tell, because I was getting, like, my whole stomach and ribs done, so, like, But you got your feet done, too? No, 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 that's Tinez, that's Tinez, that's Tinez, my feet done. So you just got your stomach done by him? Yeah, stomach and ribs, like, all the way up to, like, my nipples. Yeah, no, it was brutal, it was. The worst How many out, sessions but. is it here? I think it took like six sessions. Six sessions. Like, oh, man, that's not much, bro. I thought yeah, it was gonna yeah. be like ten. No, it was like six sessions. About like that's a little over thirty hours, baby. Hell yeah, yeah. that's a song. You got your whole back and
Yeah, yeah. Let's catch bro. up, bro. Uh, hey, one more question. Let's take a quick. Oh, what's what the best technique to do solid color techniques? Oh, solid color. No, it's all in the wrist, bro. It's all in the wrist. Ah, it's in the flick of the wrist. The way you pass it. No, no, I don't do color, so I can't. I mean, I do, I do, but I haven't done it in a while. Bro, it's easy, bro. Literally, it's just the way you pack. That's all. You figure out the way you pack. Think of yourself as a machine. Don't look at it as oh, how's it looking? Fuck that. You pack that shit the same way everywhere you go, and then you just move slowly, move down slowly. I do small circles, and then you just pack it. With with color, you have to punch that shit in, pack that shit in. Turn your machine down so you can pack it longer. If you turn it up and you think it's gonna hit it harder, it's not. Because yeah. you'll have to go so much faster. So just yeah, my tear up the skin faster, yeah, bro. easier that way too. Standard needles. Turn your machine down and pack it in little circles. Yeah. Is it? Well, I need said, to start doing more said. more color, bro. Yeah. I want to start doing color, honestly. Nah, I can't do this. Hey man, too stressful to for me. I'm about to take a quick oh, hey, five ten minute break, real quick, bro. Right. Quick break, quick break. Another question, you said? One last question, man. It's <laughs> crazy. Tattoo What's the Pretty hardest? Sure, to me, yeah. having to answer dumbass questions like that. <laughs> bro, <laughs> man. Nah, just kidding, bro. Just kidding. Hardest part of tattooing? The Shit. tattooing part? Nah, I don't fine. know, bro. I feel like it's getting to know guess, the client. I feel like the hardest part of tattooing is getting to know the client. Like getting, getting like, comfortable. Getting yeah, comfortable yeah. with them. Yeah. Like being social to the client. Yeah, yeah. especially because I'm There's some clients, bro, where I get yeah. along with them good, bro. Like, good. Yeah, like, yeah, like yeah. if it was like if I'm tattooing like my cousin or like my brother and my. Oh, yeah. But there's some clients where I be like, man, you know, you're like, just going to get the shit done. That's yeah. it, you know what I mean? That's it. Nice Do you relate sure. with a lot of your clients or no? Not really. Uh, yeah, like a handful, but I'm always like a quiet person, so I'm like, yeah, I'm, yeah. I don't really talk too much. Not that I don't want to talk to them, it's just like... Do they find you awkward? I don't know. I think I am, though. They don't ask yeah. you? They don't tell you anything? No, no. Like... I mean, some people have, like, I've had, like, I've had a couple of people <laughs> tell me, like, you know, that I'm quiet and stuff, but I'm definitely, like, really, really quiet person. That's what's up, man. Yeah, oh, for sure. I just don't, I don't know. Fuck, I've always been that way. I'm about to take a quick munch break real quick, bro, if I will be right back again. With, with, uh, with May, Tattoos by Chico. Tattoos by Chico, man. Nine one nine. Hey, 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 yeah. Hey, 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 yeah. Carlos, you good? Hey, once again, we're, ready? Ready? we're back again right here with Dark Rose Tattoo Gallery. Um... Before we start, let's send another shout out once again to my boy Carlos right there behind the cameras. And shout out to Mike. <laughs> <laughs> nah, no, no, shout out to my boy Mike Ink Dabs. What is it? Ink Lobs? Ink Dabs? Ink Dabs? Abre los ojos, coño. Nah, but shout out to my boy right here, Carlos, uh, behind the mic. Behind, behind the mic. <laughs> behind the cameras and the and the, and the video and everything. Um, we got my boy Chico here. Um, we were just talking about, um, before you got here, bro, we was talking about uh, Carlos. That his TRX don't burn out. Oh yeah. Well, like I'm like that. And and and, 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 and I can't even talk shit, bro, because like I can't even afford one. Yeah, me neither. Yeah. Nah, shout out to Carlos, bro. Michael, Mike. That's too much. That's too much. Shout out to Carlos. (laughs) Bonfield. Okay. There we go. There we go. There we go. Shout out to everybody. So Frankie Orozco, Frankie Morquecho, Frankie Ocampo. Frankie Estrada, um, let's get back to where we were, bro. Um, what do you think about the tacos? Oh, they're good. They're good. You they're fucking stuffed. 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 Yeah. We get the stuffed crust tacos. <laughs> bro, I feel like that's gonna be a tradition now. Like any yeah. anybody we get on the podcast, we, we get always them ask them. Yeah, we, I think we asked what Carlos. We asked. Uh, was it? Was my name? Zach. Zach. Sailor Jerry. Yeah. No, Zach. My bad. <laughs> Sailor Zach. <laughs> Sailor Zach. Sailor. Yeah. Like Sailor Jerry. About that like, tattoo yeah. shop. Uh, no, nah, but yeah, that's just just another question that we always give them when we come yeah. back from the break and stuff because we always try to munch. No, it's some tacos uncool, are good, now. Yeah. They straight. Yeah, they ate before I got here they too. Not so little, like they really they ain't no Cali tacos, but they're nah, tacos. Nah, yeah, definitely not. But they're, 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 I feel yeah, like they're Cali big, tacos. Yeah. Are I feel like they're up there, bro. They're pretty good. No, they're good. They're good. Yeah, they ain't all that, but they're good. They're really. I've good. had some bad Cali tacos though too. Me too. That's what I was saying. Anywhere in Long Beach, I was in Long Beach. I'm like, anywhere in Cali, you're gonna get tacos. I feel like I feel like LA, no, LA, LA, LA tacos for sure, bro. Sure. LA tacos, bro. Street tacos. Yep. Street tacos. Street tacos. I mean, there's a lot of like little mom and pop's places too. They're all bomb. Like, or most of them, I'd say. Damn, I love food. What yeah. um? That's what I like going out there. When you went to Cali, bro. When, well, you said you went to LA, right? To Compton. Yeah, I was in Compton what, um, and Anaheim. What's what what what's your favorite taco spot out there? Or that you go to like? Taco like, spot. How many times you say you go out there? Um, you said, oh, you born out there? You said. Yeah, I was born out there. Yeah, I was born out there. But this year, I've only gone once. 
yeah, yeah like just like before that, ago. did you go like often? Or? Yeah, uh, last year I went twice. Uh, the year before that, I went again. Like, okay. I'm trying to go like a few times a year, with tattoos, and then just like enjoy myself out there. Hell yeah, man. Hell yeah, bro. I love I love LA, bro. Yeah, but you like, never tried um Leo's tacos? It's a, it's a taco truck. That should be staying open till like three, four in the morning. Nah, nah, nah. nah my cousin one time, last the time. first, the first, I think the first year or second year, me and my wife went. Uh, we were hungry, bro, as fuck, bro. Like at two, three in the morning, bro. You know, a whole long day of just chilling, drinking, yeah. chilling, smoking, bro. We was hungry as fuck, like at two in the morning, bro. There was a taco truck. I think it was Leo's, <coughs> Leo's taco Leo's truck. truck. Go check them out, Leo's taco truck. They stay open till like four, three in the morning, bro. Yeah. We went out there like at two in the morning and went and ate tacos. Yeah. Bomb ass tacos, bro. No, my cousin, just in the hood, though. Yeah, no, my cousin took me to a place though. called uh, Tacos uh, Los Cholos. Tacos Los Cholos? Yeah. Hey, some shit I'd probably bomb. eat, though. Like my favorite, uh, so my favorite, to... yeah, my favorite spot out there is uh, at Pollo Fino, though. Pollo like, Fino. Yeah, I, I went there. You ever eat on fuck? What's that King Taco? King Taco? Nah, I haven't had that. You know King Taco? Yeah, nah, I I know of it, but I know Pollo Loco. Pollo Loco is good. No, nah, no, nah, uh, it's. All right. I mean, I, I said uh, at Pollo Fino. Oh, Pollo Fino. Yeah, it's like a little little spot. They, I thought they you had like Pollo Loco. El Pollo Fino. Uh, Pollo Loco. Yeah, yeah, no, that, that, that one's alright. Yeah, no, you know what I'm talking about? Okay. Yeah, that's like a fast food spot, but the other one is like another place, like a little little mama's pot spot. <laughs> nah, shout out to Mike, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Mike, 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 Mike. But, um, no, um, LA's got some bomb ass tacos, bro. Yeah. The last time Absolutely. I went, the yeah. last time I went to Cali, to LA, we stayed in, um, fuck, well, my boy stays in Huntington Park, Florence, Park. Florence yeah, area. Yeah, yeah. We stayed there for like a week. And, bro, you walk outside, bro, and it's like, bro, it's the hood, but like, they got some bomb ass tacos yeah, in the corner, yeah. bro. Like, there's a lady. Just sitting out there with her, like a little, little cart. Yeah, like a little, like the shit that we be doing out here, bro. The yeah. little, come see my son. Yeah, a flat the little, top. Yeah. A flat yeah, top. A little car with a flat top. That's how it is out like just there. Just banging like, the tacos out, bro. Yeah. You know what I mean? We went out there. You went to what you went out there? Yeah, too, yeah. I love it out here, bro. That's there. nice, bro. I love it, bro. Yeah, it's, 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 not, like that. it's yeah. not like that out here in North Carolina. It's a whole different environment. It's a whole different environment. Even if you go to like New York, Miami, Florida, wherever, bro, like you're not going to find. Nothing like Texas or no. LA or Cali. Right. Everywhere's Cali, different. Yeah, you know? Texas is Texas. Nice. Everywhere's oh, different, like bro. The West Coast in general, yeah. the, the East, well, what's that? Northwest, East, West, West yeah. Coast, West Coast. The West Coast is just fucking dope, bro, yeah. in general, bro. I like um, Texas food, too. Texas yeah, food is good. good. Texas food is good. Really good, bro. Florida food is good. I like it. Yeah, yeah, I feel like Florida food is more like Latin food. Yeah, yeah. definitely. It's like more like, uh, like Puerto Rican, Cuban. Yep. Uh, Dominican, yeah, uh, Zavi. Uh, he has took me to like, or he had bought like a Brazilian pizza. He's from where's he from? He's from Brazil, Brazil. Okay, yeah, Brazil. like had like, the best pizza. Brazilian. Yeah, the best pizza like I ever had. It was Brazilian pizza. Like, oh yeah, yeah. He bought like, well, no, nah, like he had gone to like a spot like in in Florida somewhere like right where he lives. Oh, it was okay, the best okay. pizza I ever had. Yeah. Oh okay okay. So they probably have stuff like that in Florida yeah, too. Then. Yeah. Oh well, I mean, I feel like Florida's just that state where like people from like. Like the Latin America goes Just all that yeah, culture, yeah, yeah. Like Cuba. Colombia, yeah, yeah. what is it? Cuba, yeah. Puerto Rico, Dominican, Dominican yeah. Republic. Uh, Make sure it's a big yeah, mixture, yeah. bro. Yeah, even like Venezuela type people. Yeah, know? it's like all, all South America, <laughs> yeah. or even like America, North Latino America. Están hablando, man. <laughs> <laughs> nah, plan, bro. Hey, shout out to my boy Mike, bro, man. <laughs> Behind the cameras, man. Hey, we just talking shit to him, <laughs> but uh. Nah, bro. Um, shit, bro. You say you got to work tomorrow? Me? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I work tomorrow. What you got to do? Shit, cool I got to check. I don't know. <laughs> I got to always <laughs> figure out, like, the night before. Like, I I did my designs and everything, like, the night before. Yeah, yeah. I'm always designing for, like, the next client, so. Just oh, yeah. Do you, um, to you, bro. Oh, that's another question, yeah. bro. Yeah. Um. So, like, how how far do you book out? Usually, like, a month or two. A month? Yeah. A month? Like, like, a month, usually. Like the max I'll book out is like two, like two, two months. Yeah, yeah, yeah. like I, I won't book even. Do like you in, like do you um, how do you do like how do you, how do you go about like designing tattoos? Do you like design it in front of them or do you like send them? In no, I don't ahead of time or no, like, no, just the day kinda, of. I kind of feel like that's like a, it's like a like a, like it could be a good thing and a bad thing if you. No, I just show them like the day of like the design like because yeah, yeah. you know, it's. They tell me, like, what they the want to get, like, the details and stuff, and then I just you design it, like, of? yeah, yeah okay, the day okay. of, and then if they want to do any, like, minor changes, like, we'll do it, like, the day of, but if they want to do, like, big changes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, we'll just, like, reschedule for, like, the next, like, day available. Okay, okay. Yeah. You ever have anybody get mad at you for doing stuff like that, or? Uh, no, not really. Some people, like, do want to see the design ahead of time, but 
Um, I have I plans, might. bro. Sometimes yeah. that like, I feel like when you sit there and do it like last minute type thing, like y'all can kind of go like head to head, back and forth. Yeah. But it's the yeah. same thing though. If you do it, if you send them a um, a image beforehand, though, yeah. too. I feel like it's the same thing though. No, I, I just don't send them anything too because like some people are like too picky and they're gonna change like too yeah, many yeah. things up. Yeah. Like they're also coming to you like I to really get your do, artwork. Do with them in you know? person instead of text, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. messages. Yeah, like that way. Like, like we get like really yeah because like, like, like a through text. messages like they can say one thing but like means something else. So, you know like yeah, it'd be like confusion like through like messages for sure. Like that's why I like doing it like in person if there's any minor changes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You generally can describe, like, you can describe your idea better when you're a person too. Yeah, yeah. You can show them exactly what you mean, where and how, you know? Yeah. yeah. But yeah, generally yeah. like they give me like freedom like to do like my yeah. style or like how, you know, so I wanna so, do it. Have you ever had anybody like that you get there and like y'all just going back and forth, bro? Like uh I haven't had it happen like too often, but it, it every now and then, yeah. Like it'll take like a few hours to like redesign something and just start late and have to do like multiple sessions on it instead of finish it in in one day. You do everything like um, your booking is through um, all online or through like emails. I do multiple ways. Uh, the best way to do it is like filling out the form like on my bio. <laughs> the uh, filling out the form in my bio. Hey, shout out to Frankie. Frankie underscore tattoos or whatever. Fuck. <laughs> what? Frankie Inc. Frankie Inc. <laughs> Right. Yeah, best way uh, filling out the form. Go on Facebook with you. Filling out the form online, and then like my client or my assistant. Oh, you, like, oh it's, it's all online then. Uh, that's the best way to do it. I do do it sometimes like through messages. Um, like some people have like my number or like uh, Instagram, Facebook. Um, but sometimes I don't really check it. Like if I'm being honest, like I'm yeah, really bad yeah, at checking yeah. messages. Like. No, and yeah, then, like, I mean, we, know, I mean, we're all we're all bad at that stuff. Yeah, and then you know, like you post a story, honest, man, you get like, like reactions. Like, it just like gets lost in there. Like it's it's a lot, and then. You, and I feel like the only reason I keep up with my stuff now, bro, is because my my wife does that shit. Yeah. Me, bro. Like she has That's my uh, well, she has all like the booking info stuff. No, bro. I've been trying to get. So she does like, all that for it. me, bro. So I don't have nothing to worry no, about. No. I just worry about getting to the shop and oh, your clients here. Doing, oh. doing a good job tattooing. Yeah. No, so yeah. she handles everything, bro. Yeah. No, I, feel I, like, I feel like that could be a big help. Yeah, I've been, I've been trying to get better at myself. Find, she could find you a real one. Yeah, but uh, you know no, I, mean? I have like an assistant. <laughs> <laughs> I do have like an assistant. Like, <laughs> if you do it through her, like she'll like message you like back like for sure. Like, yeah, it yeah. might like take like a few days. So like, you gotta trust them though like, too, bro. Yeah, trust. Get through like the process, but that's the best way to do it. Yeah. But you could definitely, you know, always message me as well. That's what's up. So they can message you on Instagram and yeah, like, Instagram or you know, yeah, me as a friend on Facebook. Um, yeah, you know, I, I, yeah. Uh, yeah. Hey man, talking about Facebook, man, you be cracking me up, bro, on Facebook, bro. <laughs> yeah, sharing me. That's the only you reason got, I got, you got Facebook. You got him as a friend on Facebook or no? Yeah, I'm pretty yeah, sure. Yeah, that's the only reason I got Facebook. Bro, you know, share me. You be killing me, bro. On you. <laughs> <laughs> this shit you be posting, bro. Yeah, yeah. Hey man, but that's the up, bro, man. Oh shit! Somebody asked me earlier. Would you ever get your face or neck tattoo? You don't got. Oh, you got your neck tattoo. Oh, you got your face. Yeah, tattoo. Yeah, I got like my neck and like. He's already got his face like and neck tattoo. Yeah. I'd yeah, get some there. Yeah. Rose. On the sideburn. Yeah, it wasn't too bad. No, nah. Especially like the month before, I had just finished. Did like it hurt? My stomach. It hurt? Nah, nah. I was just chilling there. But like the month before, I had just finished my stomach and ribs. So like compared to oh, that, yeah. like it was. I was just chilling there. I was like, man, this is, this is peaceful. <laughs> Who we got? Who we got? Domino's Pizza. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> Try to send me a shot. <clears throat> oh, you want a shot? Hell yeah, fuck it. You don't want me to give you a shot. Nah, but it's even another way. Let's go. Damn. She's with yeah. the uh, sun tone. Oh, David, straight the voicemail. <laughs> <laughs> Shane, pick up. He's about to go all fun right now. <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. Just kidding. No, I'm mad now, bro. Nah, <laughs> nah, bro. I'm playing, bro. I'm about to call my homeboy real quick, man. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> bro had so, so much good content that time that... Like, bro, I think, like, yeah. The video that yeah, didn't record. Yeah, yeah. yeah. People Tragic. called and they were talking shit. Yeah. And, like, all kinds of shit <laughs> and we Man, fucking missed all that missed all of it yeah. Yeah. both cameras weren't recording or you just only had one it was the audio oh it was just yeah, the audio, audio. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I think yeah. I can like no audio at all like not even like quiet like every time the, we were on the phone with somebody it was just 
their their side wasn't working. I think. Oh, nah, that's what you yeah, yeah, I think anything. it was their side on their side. So we're just looking like idiots talking to ourselves. Nothing. That makes sense. Yeah, that's it. And I think one of the microphones was different, and it was recorded in a different volume, or some shit like that. I don't know. Bro. There was a lot of shit that <laughs> was going wrong. You learn, man. You learn. Yeah. Bro. We need to get them back up there too, bro. Who was it? who was it? Was it? You said it was Jay and yeah, Carlos. Carlos. What the first time? The time that we couldn't post the one that. Oh uh, yeah, we had Jay and Carlos. Right. It was just Jay and Carlos. We should get him back, back up here. Cause we had Carlos not long ago. Yeah. Bro, we yeah. should do one on Cinco de Mayo. We'll have everybody here and just have everybody like kind of yeah. whatever. We we'll just come up here and fucking we'll have a live band and everybody. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> so everybody speaking at once. Get a shit little yeah, microphone. Yeah, just live throughout. Yeah. Kind of like a blog or like video, yeah, yeah. like a live. Yeah, yeah. Like hey, live. Yeah, that'd be dope, like coming in and out of it yeah. if you want. You know, you don't have to be in it. You can be in it if you want. Yeah. You can drink it, whatever. Think, whatever. Sign what a waiver. Nah, just <laughs> definitely, <laughs> definitely. Yeah. <laughs> What's your questions, bro? You have any like questions for? Cause, mm. I mean, we've even got a couple times, bro. Like we talked about earlier, but yeah. like you know, we really need it. What's your I guess like a, what's your long term goals in life? Long term goals in life. Shit. Yeah, for all. Oh, yeah, for. Uh, you ever, what do you see? Um, you ever, have you ever you ever worked for yourself, bro? Like. Uh, no. Uh, well, let me. Well, let that, me, that's why I was gonna ask. Let like, me ask uh, you this first, though. Um, did you? Uh, oh shit! Hold on. Let me see this Yo. Can you hear us? Yo. Yo. Yo, can you hear us? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You good? Can you hear? Yeah, bro. Yeah. yeah. You better not be calling if you have no fucking hobos on there. Jesus Christ. Man. <laughs> All right, Brady. All right, Brady. <laughs> oh, you got me live? Uh, yeah, bro. You're live right now, bro. You're live. Yeah, you're lucky I didn't say something even crazier than that. What are y'all talking about today? Uh, we're here with my boy Chico, bro. He's from uh, Durham, Raleigh, Durham. Right? Raleigh, I'll Raleigh. Touch out of Raleigh. He came yeah. like an hour and a half. Sorry to, so, sorry to hear that, Chico. Yeah, it's all right, man. It's, it's all this right. one of my, this is one of my, my Trump supporter clients. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> nah, I'm playing, bro. Hey, Trump, yeah, Trump I was, but he's not maybe. strong enough for me anymore, huh? Hold on. You said, so how, how you know these guys, Chico? Um, where did I meet you guys? Uh, through Carlos, right? Can you hear us good, some, bro? Some party either Cinco de Mayo. Yeah, I can hear you fine. Convention. Oh, yeah. Right. I don't know, bro. yeah, I think it was like through Cinco de Mayo, like a few years ago. Like, yeah, I think it was. Like, I think I, I've known you at least for like five, at least five years. Was it five years? years? I yeah, feel like it's least, been like bro. four years, like three, think, four years. I think we just happened to all be Mexican and we all got invited to the yeah, same party. Yeah, yeah, Here we go with the Mexican <laughs> jokes. Who's the best cook? <laughs> Who's the best cook? Oh, Who's the best cook? Oh, man, you better put me on the fucking oh, spotlight like that. I ain't why? Ain't nobody say Pelon. <laughs> let me call, let me ask you this. Let me ask you this. Y'all ever had fried bologna? Because I know we were talking to Pelon. Bro, he don't know nothing about bologna? he don't know yeah, nothing about that spam. fried bologna. It's nah, just good. Nah, I've had fried yeah. spam. Yeah. I've had fried spam. Spam's good. Spam's good. No, no. fuck that fried spam. Y'all gotta go on fried <laughs> bologna. I'll show y'all. I'll, that's the one thing I can show y'all boys how to cook. Fried bologna. Fried bologna. Yeah, I think I've tried it. we had the YouTube video. We had the YouTube video at one day. Pelon didn't believe me. Yeah, we yeah. had this old pedophile looking dude on YouTube showing his kid how to cook some fried bologna. <laughs> you sure it was his kid? Mm, they said it was. I don't know. He's like banned <laughs> off YouTube now. Damn, He's probably banned off YouTube now. I don't know. But yeah, yeah whenever y'all want to learn how to cook, y'all let me get down there. I can cook y'all some fried bologna from them microwave nuggets. All right, yeah, because uh, Pelon's tacos he's, be a little dry. He said he said he's going to buy the Damn, bro. Nah, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> he said my tacos nah, there we go. Everybody says my tacos like that? You said what? Y'all going to let him talk about your tacos like that, Pelon? <laughs> nah, man. I guess not. I don't so know. Who's got, who, who is the best cook at all, y'all? Who can cook the best? Right here for us three? Shit. Yeah. Not, not me. Of course. Not that, me. Uh, Daddy. Right here. Daddy here. <laughs> Are you talking... I don't know who you're talking about. You must not be talking about you. I don't know. They, they just said the tacos were dry. Yeah, he's got his moments. Yeah, they're, they're straight. He's he's like, man, every, don't, don't let them fool you, bro. He's up and down, you know. Don't let them fool you, bro. It should be smacking. So so what did you say the guest name? Was his name Carlos? Is that what you said his name was? No, Chico. His name's Renee, Chico. but they, they call him Chico. Chico. Yeah. All right, Chico, what do you do? Do you do tattoos or how do you know these? Yeah, do you yeah. I the the, All right, what's, what's your worst client story, bro? Uh, What's the one where you were like, all right, man, this guy, I can't uh, deal with this. I don't want to do, go through that again. Uh, this one client that I had to fire like a little over a year ago, um, he was really picky about everything, wanted me to change everything up. 
the day of and I did it exactly how he wanted me to and then um kept telling him it wasn't gonna come out good and it was gonna come translate like as a good tattoo and he kept insisting on wanting to get it and I was like, All right, I'm gonna tattoo it. Tattooed it on Yeah, that's how I do Pallone. Yeah. <laughs> tattooed it I'm on trying him, to find some way like, to cover all this shit up. Blast yeah, over. Yeah, I they just black it out. Uh, blast over. Uh, I don't think they're fixing that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying to get somebody to black my shit out, man. He, he honestly, he's got me too messed up. But it is what it is. Um, <laughs> nah, nah bro, I don't know. Y'all's job dealing with them clients. Nah, is, does it get annoying when they ask you to change everything? No. Nah. Like, have you ever been like, nah, bro, I'm not. I'm sorry, I'm not doing. I'm not changing. No, nah, no. Nah, like, uh, I'll let them like change it up. I mean, it's gonna be on them. But like, if they're like super picky about like every single detail, then you know, like, I'll definitely like let them know, like, hey, like. Um, you know, you came to me like for my artwork, not you know, mm-hmm. not to be like really picky or like mm-hmm. if you want it exactly like how you're showing me this tattoo, then you know, go to that <laughs> artist because you know, like I'm doing my own custom tattoo, you're coming to me for my artwork, you know, yeah, for sure. How about the Goldsboro boys? What do y'all think? When, when is it too much? Is there is there a point where you're like, all right, look, <clears throat> I've already changed three things? Is there is there like a <laughs> Is there a limit where y'all are like, yeah, I ain't changing no more? Or you leave it kind of up with the client, you just kind of feel it out? It just really depends on the design and how what all their idea is. You know, it's just yeah. a hard to get along with client or a hard to work with client. Like, I can definitely do oh, what they sure. want, but, you know, at the end of the day, is their skin, is their tattoo, so I might not be happy with the work, but as long as they're happy with it, fuck it, you know? At the end of the day, if I try, I try my best to give them my idea, but they don't, if they don't, like, if they don't want to flow with my idea, fuck it, you know, I'll give them exactly what they want. Do it exactly how they want it, you know. They'll probably come back later and say, "Oh, well, you were right, and this and that. I should have done this. I should have done that." Cool. I've had a lot of people that you know they come back and say, "Damn, I should have just done what you said." Yeah. So you know, you, you just give them what you, learn, you right? what they want. Yeah. You I'll give them what to... they want. You just press harder, make it hurt. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Nah, nah, it's fine. You, you lay give it in there, bro. We always give one hundred percent. It's just sometimes you just oh gotta yeah think, for like, sure definitely you know? like always like sometimes you gotta just give in yeah. and give them what they want because it's their tattoo it's you know yeah 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 for sure it's your skin yeah i've never day. seen y'all give less than 100 when i've been in there i've only been in there for about 200 hours so i don't know <laughs> i don't know y'all that well but yeah I've, I've only seen y'all give it y'all's best so far so what if somebody come in there what if somebody came in there what's the one thing is there something where you're like not doing it bro if a man came in and was like hey man I need my pito tattooed. Are y'all gonna be like? Are y'all gonna be like? Yeah, I got you. Or no, Colin, you tattooed the little rooster, right? I, yeah, I guess. You know, I guess. I didn't. Yeah. I mean, now we we're talking about that, but I, I guess yeah. I just, I just said, that's it. You have to, to Pallone, my guy. I'm like, hey, yeah, my boy Pallone does it. We don't specialize in that, but we got a nah, sure, that so if a guy came in, if a guy came in and he said, "Hey, I've got three thousand dollars, but I want my Peter blacked out." Hey man, no, that's two thousand fucking that. dollars, dog. Hey, I call my boy Pelona. Be like, hey, <laughs> what the fuck? Why is it always me? <laughs> I call him up too. Like, hey, hey bro, three thousand dollars, bro. You're not gonna fucking play. I'll be like, you want to do a collab? Do this shit in five minutes. <laughs> I wouldn't do it either. <laughs> no, <laughs> five thousand. Sounding like you five are. Thousand. Nah, nah, I wouldn't do it. I just. I'm like, bro, you better be ready like, to sit for like an hour, bro, because I'm out of fucking run that motherfucker like at ten. So if a dude came in there with ten thousand dollars, I'm talking to David. He's saying, he keeps saying he, no. dude, he's saying that he's saying it because there was one time I was telling him that I had a client one time, bro, that he came in. This was like, fuck, bro, like 10 years ago, maybe I was like 22, 23 years old. He came in. And he was he wanted a rooster, bro, on his on his on his shit. Right. Yeah. Here. But he didn't want it like on his thing. But like he like wanted the head to be poking out his like underwear. But like he wanted the, the, the body to be on like his like, you know, like, you know, the little yeah, part, yeah, yeah. part of your skin where before your shit started. Yeah. So like right there, bro, he wanted the whole rooster to be there. I'm like, bro, I'm like, fuck, bro. And I told him, I'm like, like, hey, man, I'm like, and, and like, he came in, he was like, hey, this is what I want. And I was like, hey, uh, $600. He was like, that's it? And I was like, <laughs> I was just playing with him, bro. I was like, fuck. $600 fuck. deposit, you hey, said. That shit, that shit only took like 30 minutes to do, bro. Uh, uh, I got $600 from that shit. I probably wouldn't do it today, though. $600. Oh, this is Blake. Did, did you tell them about the elephant ears you put on each side of mine? <laughs> he tripping. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, I don't know. So what? there's no price tag to black one out. Because nah, if you give me one, I'm going to drive up there in about an hour. Nah, not no right. more, nah. <laughs> Man, y'all must, y'all must not need money as bad as I do, boy. I'd be like, yeah. I'm like, yeah give I'll let you borrow my machine, man. I'll let you borrow my machine. I'll, I'll hit you up. If somebody uh, wants one, I'll hit you I'll up. I'll like let you borrow this. my machine. I just want I'll a little percentage. Like I just want a little percentage. I, I'll use it on myself, and we'll go viral. We're going to need a hell of a lot of ink, my boy. <laughs> We're going to need a hell of a lot of ink. 
But let me let y'all go. Let me get you. Uh, right, let me get man, back to it. Good talk to you, man. All right, boy. I'm about to go to the next call. Hello. Yo. Yo. Hey, Joe. Yeah. What are you? What are you? <laughs> Bro, you don't sound the same. You I grew. know my miss. So you grew. Bro, you sound different. Oh, you got me on the damn live. Hold on, who's this? My bad, bro. I might have called the wrong number. <laughs> who, you, who you calling? <laughs> who's this? I love La Verga. Up. You thought hang up? Or... What up, La Verga? Who's this? You said what? Who's this again, bro? My bad. Damn, I probably called the wrong number. Joe Way. Joe? Yeah, bro. Yeah. Not my mess. Yeah. Say, nah, bro. You sound different way. <laughs> For real? Hell yeah. Nah. Hey, wait. Yep, yep, yep. It's the, we're live right now, bro, with my homie Chico, bro. Oh, word. Hell yeah. It's the, you say it's the, you any tattoo questions for him, bro, or what? Uh, not really, wait. I mean, uh, at the moment, no. I ain't never really. haven't thought about anything right now. It's the, Honestly. Okay. He said make a double. He said you're going to take a shot, we okay? <laughs> how, how, how difficult is it to do, uh, like, portrait tattoos? Um, hey, wait, you're gonna be, you're it's gonna pretty be, difficult. You're gonna, like, uh, you're gonna be on live on the, on the video too. Yeah, it's that's uh, cool. It's it's pretty difficult. Like if you're doing like a family member, because you got to get it. Like, exactly hey, wait, you like sound them. like you sound like a grown ass man. <laughs> oh no, my man, no. <laughs> like, no. chilling. I'm out here in fucking <laughs> Stafford, Virginia. Way. Oh, okay. I hear you now. I hear you now. I hear you now. You yeah. You I, I, see, you I, I came out. I, I came out. I came outside. I think inside is just different. Mm -hmm. I like the echo. Oh yeah, but yeah. How, I mean, I guess you got to be specific on the detail. Yeah, because you get like a little detail wrong, like it could look, you know, like somebody else. Like it won't look like them. So, like if you, you know, change up the nose or the eye comes out like a little, you know, different. It's it's not gonna yeah. look like them exactly. So. Oh yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. How, how, what's what's the hardest one you've done? Hardest one I've done. Ooh, probably. Probably my parents' portraits I did on my sister. Just cause, really? Yeah. That shit always be hard, bro. Yeah, just because I like the references like were really small, like like fingernail size, like their faces, and like I blew them up to like, um, like half a dollar size, kind of like a little picture like frame. Yeah. You know, yeah. like the Polaroid yeah. pictures, so, like they're like inside like little Polaroid pictures. Nice. And, gotcha. Yeah, and I mean, I, I've seen a lot of people that try to do portraits, and I mean, to in order to do a portrait, man, it's just I think honestly, that's just probably like the hardest details thing you could probably do, in oh, my yeah, opinion. Definitely. The way I see it. Hell yeah. And if you can do that, man, you, you know you got a lot of talent. It takes a lot of skill to do all that. Yeah, hey, man. Um, that's my boy Joe right here, bro. Is that he does um, like construction, flooring, anything, bro. Hit oh, yeah. him up, bro. Oh, yeah, definitely. Shout out to my boy Joe. Come, come on, come on, come on, come on. Construction company. Construction company. I bet. Hold on, hold on. Say it one more time. On Tavares Construction Company. Hello, we're going to Tavares Construction <laughs> Company. Go follow him. Right. Go follow us on Facebook. Follow us on Facebook. Follow we're on up Facebook. there. On Tavares Construction Company. Yes, stop. For all your remodeling construction needs. Shit, we'll have to look right, you up, bro. man. Yeah, stop us. All right, bro. Let's be easy, bro. All right, man. Y'all have a good night. Anyway. Oh, yeah. No problem. All right, brother. Yeah, boys, be safe. You, you too, too, bro. You too. Uh-uh. Hey, Lo said to call him. Lo, Lo said to call him. Lo's. Call him? No, no, both Lo's. Carlos and Lo's. And both. I'm on three way. Lo's, Lo's is the one I'm telling you for favor. Yeah, yeah. Carlos is Carlos Bonfield. <coughs> oh, okay. Yo. Yo, what's up? Yo. Yo, yo. 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 What's up, bro? We're here with my boy Chico. We're live right now, bro. We got. Oh, y'all still live? We yeah, finally yeah. got that shit right, bro. We're recording the phone calls and everything. <laughs> What's going on, Chico? He says, about up, time. He said, hey, Carlos, it's about time you got that shit right, boy. <laughs> yeah, I was like, damn. He, for long he was like, oh, open up. Like, Chico's coming through. I was like, about damn time, bro. <laughs> yeah, Where you at, bro? Took a while. Damn, your boy's out there late. Yeah, bro, yeah. We, started, we started like at 7. 
And we're still yeah, going. I got a, I, I got out late. We pointing man. no fingers out here, but we're waiting on someone. Finish. <laughs> right, yeah, yeah. I ain't pointing no elbows or nothing. Yeah. But I mean, I'm gonna get it right, bro. Me, bro. <laughs> took me. It took him like ten podcasts to get it right. You know how you know how to be, bro. I guess it's me all the time. It's me, me. A little bit, little bit. They are, they are. That's what's coming, bro. Where you at? I know, man. I got out late, bro. Shit, we all. Es que lo regañan, pues. Yeah, la pega. I know, dude. You about to be like the lone. Eesh. The big, the great fall of <laughs> the bomb field. Hey man, it's tough having kids, dog. <laughs> Damn. I'm telling you, bro. David's about to get there. Nah. <laughs> he yeah. said David's about to get there. What time is it? <laughs> I'll still be out Chico, here. what's up with you, bro? When, what's up, man? When, when are you going to join the club, dude? What you mean, join the club? With the kids, bro. Oh, man. I don't for know real? about that. No. Damn, <laughs> hey, bro, how old are you getting from? I just turned. Mine? Uh, no, no, I'm telling you. Oh, Chico, how I just you? turned 30. 30? Yeah. Damn, bro, fuck, don't wait too long, dog. Yeah, I know. Don't That's what I'm saying, long, bro. bro. You're going to be over there. I got my dogs, man. I got my dogs. Those are my kids. Hey, man. <laughs> They'll take care know. of me. I thought you went and got a one for Cali? Is that, is that yeah, what you went to Cali for? Yeah, well, yeah. part of the reason I went out there. Carlos said you done got what's snipped, up, bro. He said good. You said what? That's what I'm saying, dude. I'm already. I'm out, bro. You snipped already, though? Hell yeah. He said you got the game. He's out. He's smart. He's smart. Yeah, bro. He said bye. He's smart. <laughs> he about to be out there. What you boys getting into, man? Yeah, you chilling, dog. We about to, we about to go to Mezcalitos. Shit. Yeah? Yeah, we about to go get fucked. <laughs> I'm about to watch them get fucked up. <laughs> nah, bro. We just chilling, bro. Bro, hey, next time. So I have that thing for uh, to go live, too, bro. Next time, like, hit me up. We'll join the the lives. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. For sure. You yeah. know what I mean? But, bro, we, bro, I mean, you trying to pay, point no elbows, but we always start this shit kind of late, bro. You know what I mean? That's what I'm saying, dude. <laughs> I'll be out here. I'll be ready. I'll be ready since, since like, 3 in the morning. Hey, but you know how Carlos over there paid the back and forth, bro. Like, ready to go, huh? For real, bro. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah, he's nah that's what's up, like, man. Nah, bro. Hey, y'all, y'all still coming? Y'all still coming uh, for the, the event or what? Yeah, yeah, for sure. If, if, be. If, if my son, yeah, I know, me. I know, David's not gonna be out, right? I mean, I'll try to make it, bro. I ain't gonna lie, I'll try to make it. Come on, bro. We'll find it. Let's start thinking of excuses right now, yeah. dude. Yeah, that, should right. that should be. That should be. Real. Watch, watch. I, I, should, I should be there. I'll be all right. What day was it again? It's in December. It's gonna be the 14th, bro. December, right, bro? Yeah. December. Yeah, yeah, yeah. December 14, bro. Oh, yeah. that's like the mid mid December. It's gonna, so yeah, this, this year is gonna be the second the second Saturday, bro. December. Uh, All right. Uh, yeah, that's even All better. Right. Gotta mark that. I know yeah. you. I know you boys booked out like two years in advance, bro. But hey, <laughs> do it on I'll Christmas. Be I'll be lucky. Oh, I'll be lucky if yo, I get booked two weeks, bro. Right now, your yo boy, your boy's about to go look for some construction work, bro. Yeah, let me know. Y'all need to work and fill. Get some side hustle, dude. <laughs> I refuse to do TikTok dances, dog. I'm, <laughs> I refuse. <laughs> hey, you might have to, bro. Hey, I might have to fucking catch up, dog. God, boy, yeah. well, wait, I'll be holding on to the end, dude. <laughs> yeah. Nah, nah so man. Good yeah. here for you, boys, man. Like y'all, y'all yeah, keep killing it, bro. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, bro. bro. Yeah, hey, let's set it up. Okay. I don't know what he's doing. Let's set up, bro. Shit was dope. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. Appreciate you, bro. Hell yeah. We out with you. Yeah, bro. David, how's the shot going, man? It's good, bro. Steady. How did, how did the grand opening go, bro? Everything went well? Yeah, bro. It was, it was cool, man. We were here late, late. But yeah, everybody yeah. did a lot of tattoos. Everybody had fun. That's what's up, man. I need to stop by the shop and see how it turned out, dude. Yeah, bro. For sure. I mean, shit. Next time we have you out here, for sure, like, you know, give you the tour. Yeah, man. Let me know. We'll, we'll plan it out, dude. Take some, you know, I feel like that, you know, not, you know, taking on a serious note, man. Like, you know, that, that helps the, the podcast. Whatever you guys bring in there, like, it helps bring you know put their name out there and stuff, man. So no, yeah, bro. You know, it's like I told them, bro. I'm like we're, we're trying, bro. I'm trying to make it. Yeah, yeah bro. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's hard for everybody right now, dude. Big, like, it's, yeah, it's hard for everybody, man. So what you guys doing out there with the podcast, man? It actually like you know put put the word out there, right? Uh, yeah, I feel like nah for sure, bro. I feel like we were um we're the first ones to do it right now, bro. Like here on the on North yeah. Carolina at least yeah, yeah. or, or well, yeah. I'm not even gonna say on the East Coast in general because like and, and I it's a good time, man. You know, like. It's like the shit that we usually do. Pony Lawson did has like a podcast or some shit, no? Oh, who is it? I don't. No, 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 I've seen a few different ones. I got one. I don't. Um, But I'm saying, it's like, like, you know, how it is, like, like, when we're never with you, you know, just putting the camera in front of you guys. Like, that's it. Yeah. You know, same vibes, bro. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. All right, brother. Nah, brother. Yeah, man. Take this call real quick, bro, and get back with you. Yeah, yeah. Y'all be there, brother. All right, bro. You too. All right, bro. All right, man. Oh, All right, last one, last one, guys. Last, last one. Salud, pues. I can't, it's not.
chingado, verga. No te tiro a la verga, como quieran. Mames. I'm trying to give you one bag, no quisiste. Ya, Carlos. A ver si contesta el pecocho. Bueno. What's up, papá? Yo. Bueno. Can you hear me? Yo. Yeah. Yo, eres pelón. Pelonitsky, you bo. What's up, dog? It's Lowe's, right? Sí, güey. Uh, we're here on the podcast, bro, with um, Chico and, and David. Yo, what's up? Orale. Tell them what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? How, how you been, bro? Where you at right now? Uh, right now, I'm in, uh, I'm in NC right now at the moment. Where, 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 where? There's a cop outside right here looking at us, look. Yeah. <laughs> no, cops, no, been no. Looking at our, cops been looking at our cunt for a long time. <laughs> no, for sure, for sure. Hey, bro, <laughs> how you been? How you been, dog? Uh, bien. Uh, I just actually saw you, uh, you guys are doing the podcast. I was asking questions, but I got neglected, so I'm like, I should have mixed it. Hey, man, well, you're live right now, so you're not going to get neglected for nothing right now. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> Ask your questions, bro. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Hey, bro, you gotta, hey, man, we got we to get you up here, bro. Te pasas de verga con el pinche chacal. Hola, 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 hola. Hey, shout out to, to I Am Los. Yep. Hey, we got him out here on, on live right now. Oh, yeah. I am Los. What's your Instagram doing, name, bro? Ma. What's your name? Mahe. Huh? What's, <laughs> what's your Instagram? Hey, hey, hold up, fool. Hey, I got on live for the first time. I was actually uh, at, at uh, Mezcalitos with uh, with a friend of mine, and we were having drinks, and I'm like, I'm reading your, your, what you're writing. I'm like, why is he talking to me like that? <laughs> and I'm like, hey, what's this going on? Read it, read it. I'm like, you're sounding, you're sounding more like, like Central American over and over and over. And I'm like, entonces fue más, entonces fue hipote. And I'm like, órale. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro. It no. was, I don't know, I don't know. It was weird. I'm like, is that pelon or what? Up? That's not pelon. Uh, that, that, that's, like, that's, that's, um, that's, that's, um, that's, um, that's my hip pelon. <laughs> <laughs> Who you been hanging out with, fool? I don't know. <laughs> put up, put up, no, put up my hair. No, that's just me when I be like, like 20 shots in, bro. <laughs> For real. The first 20 shots. <laughs> hey, no, but look, bro. Hey, look, look. We're here with my, my, my guest artist. My, my, guest, oh, my guest artist. Our guest, Chico. Is the, um, you got any questions for him, bro? Like as a tattoo artist, you know, you've been on, uh, you as a, as a, as a cartel crew member. As, as a, a tattoo ambassador. As a tattoo ambassador, entrepreneur. <laughs> you got any questions for him? Any questions for my boy, bro? He's a black and gray artist too, bro. Yeah. You're asking me a question? Yes, sir, what? No, I'm saying if you have any questions. Yeah, when am I going to get on a podcast? Shit, bro, whenever <laughs> you want, bro. Whenever, bro. No, yeah. actually, no. No, actually, I've been, um, I've been actually uh, trying to talk about a lot more uh, this year. Yeah, and uh, uh, you guys have uh, you guys have been um, hey man, look. showing a lot. You yeah. guys have been showing a lot of. Let him have a lot of Okay, you get my bad, my bad. Hey man, I'm known for that shit, bro. My bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. My bad. My bad. No, you you got you guys have been uh, on, making Mike, a lot of noise. Man. Thank you, him Oh shit! <laughs> no, it was it was crazy as I'm watching the live as we speak, and then what he just said just appeared on the screen like seconds later. Oh, for real, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Let me get off the li the the actual live here, watching you guys. We're gonna get it's gonna gonna fuck me up. Um, oh, gotcha. Este, pero no, no um, <clears throat> I've been seeing you guys. No, no. Not the type of person to um, I don't really interact on on IG. Pero no, it is no significa que no miro, and you guys have been killing it, bro. Hell yeah, bro. We appreciate it, bro. Appreciate you, bro. Yeah, and we're trying, bro. I feel like I feel like if we get you up here, bro, it might help us out a little bit. I'm not trying to clout chase you or nothing like that. But you know like, no, no, no. Like we'll get you we'll get, we'll get you we'll get you a lefty gunplay up here. <laughs> nah, bro. <laughs> hey, I just found out lefty, lefty, lefty's got a mile away. I know, bro. I saw that shit. I saw that shit. Yeah, I was like, what? He's not Mexican, but I thought he was Mexican the whole time. I yeah, no, well, I thought he yeah, was. because he had, he had, I just, I just noticed, I just noticed his, uh, his thoughts, bro, and I was like, sad, my boy, my boy, my boy's, uh, my boy's he a always, he's always talking about, like, like, the Mexican people, like, he's Mexican or some shit like that. 
Right. I mean, I mean, granted, bro, you can go with pura raza. It's like Mr. Capote. Like no, yeah, yeah, there you go. Yeah. It's close enough, bro. It's yeah. the same shit. Or like, yeah, or like, it's there, bro. Not, yeah. Like Mexican, bro. It's it's it. It. Or like, or criminalgas, you, criminalgas? Like, yeah, where you grow up. Criminalgas? <laughs> 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 Hey, you, know what, hey, man, you know what I'm talking about, right? You know what I'm talking about, bro. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. No. Yeah, no, but um, no, nah, even he's like, I don't know, bro. It was, it was trippy when I when I heard about it. I was like, man, this, and I actually trip out more on the battle that's like, making sketches of him. Are you talking about um, Hater World? Yo, is it, is it him? I don't know, bro. Yeah, but you talking about you hot. talking about um, uh, fuck, how come I say wait, Blue Devil. Uh huh. Yeah, he's starting sketching yeah, the money. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot of people I, talking shit about him, though. Yeah, no, but I actually <laughs> want to sketch him out. I want to do a sketch that he can caricature, like yeah, separate yeah. his eyes a little bit. Hell yeah, that's what's up. Give a little droopy look. Hell yeah, bro. That's what's up. <laughs> but um, no, man. I mean, it's it, 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 it's um, but como te dije, no, um, I, I would love to go out there, man. And it, it, hey, bro, it's for, me, bro. For, well, let's set, well, well, let me talk to um. I'll talk to David and talk to my um, to the camera guy, bro, and we'll set something up, bro. Yeah, yeah. We'll no, I mean, like I, I, you know, no man, no man. He can say, hey, don't, don't, don't say that. Uh, um, okay. Can I hear again? No way. Be patient, fool. No, 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 yeah, invest, invest, I, and if, push if, it. invest and push it. Invest and push. Yeah, if we actually make it happen, man, yeah, yeah. Share, we fucking. No, no, fuck it, bro. No, we're going to set a date up for you, bro. Let me, just, <coughs> let, let me just look at my schedule and everybody's schedule, bro. Shit, we'll get mm-hmm. you here, bro. Yeah, for sure, bro. We need, we'll to, bro. We need to, bro. For sure. I'll be, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be in, um, I'm doing, a, well, I was supposed to go to Mexico with, uh, con, with, the, with the allegory team, but I ended up declining it. Oh, con Temo. Yeah, with yeah, Temo, yeah. Uh, Brandon. Um, oh, you're not going to go no more? No, nah, man. No, nah, it's not. No way, because it wasn't in the city. It was, oh, was going to be in Mexico yeah, City, yeah, yeah. Gotcha, but it's gotcha, an gotcha. hour out of Mexico yeah, City. But I'm not even kidding. It's in the city, and I'm like, nah, man. Nah, nah. <laughs> no, I'm not trying you, to go out to Mexico City. So <laughs> I was like, yeah, I'm good. No, I feel you, bro. No, I feel on. you. But now we're still. Damn, bro. No, I appreciate you, Wayne. It's the. Giving us your feedback. No, my man. No, bro. No, 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 bro. We keep. Hey, man. No, to be honest, you've been the best call we've had all night, bro. We've had like three, three, four calls now, like two, three calls. Hey, bro. I've been going on live with different people lately, and we've been hitting subjects like, like up the ass. Like what I've been hey, trying bro. to do right now is, is honestly talk more about the, the politics in the in the yeah, business so, right now today. <clears throat> so like, look. Gender- so like the podcast, bro. Like like we started it, bro. We started it about a month ago, like two months ago, and like we just start off like by like like doing interviews for like the tattoo artists and stuff. But I want to get I want to get into like I mean, well, like you said, bro, like politics or like business owners and like not just mm-hmm. interview tattoo artists or anything, but like interview other people, yeah. bro. You know, not just get get their side of you too. You know. But, Come on. Well, the one I just the last one I just did was with uh, John Nelson, and it was in Chicago. Hell yeah. And he he got in a few people. He got in um uh a few people in there that are you know they they do their thing in the, in the industry and shit. They got their names yeah. like he had said. And um we we spoke we we touched base on a lot of shit, but not not as much as I wanted to. It was more like fifteen minutes of it. Oh no, nah, bro! And I know. I'll let you talk. Get, shit no, here, no, I know. But they had to get bloopers. And shit. You know what nah. I mean? Because I started, I started, I started hitting every fucking thing about what the fuck I don't like about the industry now. Because yeah. I mean, once yeah. you go into a convention, it's different. Every convention is different. Every city is different. Yeah, for sure. Mm. Oh yeah, for sure, for sure, for sure. Y luego, you see a lot of these people that don't belong there, bro. They're there because of the company. 
For sure. They don't yeah. even want to be in there. And, they, and then you try to talk to them and you see the anxiety coming out of their pores. It's like, bro, you're not even one of us, bro. What the fuck are you doing here? Like, yeah, get yeah. the fuck out of the industry, dog. You're just trying to, <laughs> oh, bro, you're we, just trying to fucking, we, yeah, bro. They definitely got to get you on here, bro. Hell yeah, we got to get gotta them on here, bro. Hey, bro. They got to hey, capitalize. Hey, bro, save that. Save that. Hey, save that podcast, subject, bro. <laughs> hey, man, that's for a podcast, bro. Hey, we need to get you up here ASAP, bro. Fuck it. We'll get you in here next week. Fuck it. We, we, you can skip the line, dog. You can the line, line. Just get the line, bro. Nah, I'll, be, I'll, I'll, be, I'll be here. Just cancel your appointments. When do you guys do it on the weekdays? Or uh, the, it's the, up and down right now, bro. The last one we did was like a month ago, bro. And it was just because we were slacking and shit. But I mean, like I told these guys, bro, out, well, like I told David, bro, I'm trying to push one it out at least. Uh, I think Wednesday. At least once bro. a month, bro. I think most of them we done at on Wednesday. At least two, once, one or two a month, bro. You know what I mean? Just to get it going, you know? Um, I think the one we have I mean, today, with even, Chico, I, bro, even, I think that shit's gonna be good, though. Then. Yeah, no, I, okay. I mean, I could even get uh, that old Gordo way, uh, 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 Brandon and, and Temo in this day, too, bro. Let's do it, bro. Let's do it. Temo, hey, Temo, hey, Temo, uh, Temo would it. have a lot to say. No, oh, baby, man, hey, a... look, me and Temo are like, I don't know if you can see the live, bro, but we're like this, bro. He's cool, he's cool with me, bro. Me and Temo are cool, <laughs> yeah, bro. Temo cool, would bro. have a lot to say. Yeah, Temo's cool, bro. I'm cool with him. I'm cool with, I mean, with Tolentino, but we actually got him coming out in like maybe like two, three weeks or so, también. But um, yeah. we want to get all of them guys, all the guys, bro. Get everybody's feedback, you know what I mean, and see show, see bro. where everybody's at, you know. Well, cool. I mean, I'll, I'll give I'll give everything ready. You know, when like a uh, oh, couple, shit. like uh, a I couple said, bro, days we before, shit. we can jump the line, bro, with you, bro. You know what I mean? And not even trying to be a politician. Yeah, man. <laughs> no, I'm there. I'll, 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 so what? Are you I'll what, what? What days work best for you? Like on a Wednesday or Sunday or what? Well, you're you're you you guys are like an hour away, no? Uh, from Fayetteville, it's like, what, like an hour and 20, 30? An hour and a half. It's like an hour and a half, bro. Right? Yeah, right yeah. I mean, bro, you can stay in my shop, bro. I told you to stay in my shop the last time you came. You left, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you left, bro. You're going to put, you put me on blast, huh? <laughs> No, 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 no. I ain't trying to put you on blast. <laughs> I told you, wait, get the no, house no, in the shop, wait. No, you know, I, get out of way. I, told, I gave you the key and everything, wait. <laughs> No, 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 bro. No, bro. Nah, I'm bro. Nah, I understand, bro. Shit happens, bro. It's life, you know what I'm saying? But we're still with the guaro, bro. We're still fighting with the abuelito, my nephew. Nah, but yeah. But tell, tell me, tell me when, bro, and I put uh, schedule stuff for you. Like I said, bro, let me talk. Let me talk to David and let me talk to um to Carlos real quick, and we'll see, bro, what days work for all of us, and we'll we'll get you up here, bro, ASAP, bro, for real. Nah, repues, bro. Ya está, gallo. Be easy, brother. Right, we love way. you, brother. Take care, easy, love. Stop, papa. Be easy, all right? See you soon, Dale. bro. Hold on. Hold on. Hold up on him, <laughs> Yeah, that's the homie loves, bro. He's cool. But anyways, that was the phone calls. That was pretty much what this new podcast But back to our about. guest artist, bro. What the fuck, bro? <laughs> I mean... You're over here getting all these <laughs> no, calls no. and fucking talking to all these people. No, but I mean, that's what it's all about, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, he got, he got, he, you got to answer a couple questions, yeah. too, right? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Was I hogging everything up like David says? <laughs> nah, you good. <laughs> to be honest, bro. <laughs> he said, yeah. He said, yeah. That's okay. That's okay. pelotas. Siempre la que I won't say Pinche it. pelion. Cheers. Cheers. Pelion. Come on, Cheers. Cheers. Over there, fucking thirsty old. Yeah, pour it out. I don't think there's man. anything in there. Well, fuck it, bro. Y'all ready to wrap it up or what? Hey, hey, never wrap it up. <laughs> don't you have facts. No, facts. <laughs> nah, it's kidding. Chico said facts. Facts. Slip, uh. Do you? Do your life? Hey, bro. Um, don't forget. Before to we do start. you. Okay, wait. My bad. No, nah, it's kidding, bro. Puro, puro cagada. But what? Um, so we before we leave, bro, um, let them know once again, bro, what's your... um. Your Instagram, where to find you at? Tattoos by uh, Chico919 is my Instagram. Um, pretty much all I have. I don't really have a Facebook. It's tattoos, not my personal tattoos by, one. Tattoos by Chico on Instagram. And tattoos by Chico919. On Facebook. Um, or on Instagram. Oh, oh, on Instagram. Instagram. Yeah. Tattoos, tattoos by, by Chico. Chico. No Facebook or anything. On Facebook. Or, and what shop are you at? Uh, I got you on Old Facebook. Ghost Tattoo got, in Raleigh. Old Ghost Tattoo in Raleigh. Yeah, if y'all want to check, check his check workout check or out, yeah. go get tattooed by him. You know. Yeah. It won't hurt our feelings. Yeah, they're open shit. seven days a week. There, they do walk-ins and everything. Yes, so sir. you can check them out. Oh yeah, go check them out. Go collect the piece from them, bro. Yeah, for real, man. Y'all go check them. Yeah, I don't do walk-ins. I do appointment only. But you know, yeah. they do walk-ins. I still need to get yeah. a piece from you, bro. Yeah. Hit them up, bro. Hey, let me know. I, I, want, a piece, like, I want a piece from you. Yeah. I feel like we all need yeah. a like tattoo. Right, right. Yeah. I got a few. Yeah, yeah. I got a few. I got like Ian. I got fucking. I do too. Yeah, I want get tattooed by Ian. I need to get something from you too, bro. I need more life, bro. For real. We should have brought something out today, bro. We did that shit on live. Okay, let's do it next week. Yeah. Nah, bro, for real, man. Appreciate you coming oh, out, yeah, bro. For sure, man. Appreciate Shout out to my boy Chico man. once again, bro. Chico. Hey, let him know once again, bro. We said uh, on Instagram. Tattoos, tattoos by Chico919. Go check 
Go follow me, bro. Give me a follow. Uh, Pelon tattoos. Yeah. Pelon underscore tattoos. Ocampo tattoos. Uh, <laughs> my OnlyFans <laughs> is. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, follow, follow me, me on OnlyFans. Uh, subscribe. <laughs> oh, hold on. What? Follow, subscribe. Yeah, subscribe to my OnlyFans. No, <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. Hey, that, that's for Carlos Bonfield. <laughs> <laughs> All right, bro. Y'all be easy, man. Right, man. Appreciate y'all, bro.